not December, my favorite month of the year. Okay, that might be a lie. Like, sure, Christmas is fun. New Year's is also fun. But I'm not talking about the holidays. I'm talking about the weather. Like, one day, it could be a nice 56 degree weather. You know, just put on a hoodie and a denim jacket and you're fine. Strolling around the neighborhood with a nice fit. Nothing bothering you. Nothing heavy on you. But then out of nowhere, it could be a negative 3 degree weather with bad air quality, a snowstorm, and potential death if you stay out too long. Like, where did this come from but anyway yeah i only like snow in the parks like back when i went to school god damn was that a living hell like first my day would start out good with a nice cup of coffee or hot chocolate but then it just gets worse from there i got train delays and after i take the train i have to take a bus and that shit's either delayed or they're not in service and guess what i'm already late to school and listen i'm already a kid who comes late to school almost every day but when it comes to winter it makes my attendance look from yellow yellow green green yellow green green yellow 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 green yellow to yellow 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 red 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 yellow red yellow yellow green yellow yellow red red yellow red red yellow. yeah like no joke it was that bad but i still graduated and that's what matters shout out to my counselor miss you really are the queen of queens so that's enough of that um let's go to the actual story that took place around sixth or fifth grade me and my friend decided to go slitting after a snowstorm but since we were poor kids we just went into a nearby trash pile and picked up a big piece of cardboard to make it our sled yeah but as we got into the park we saw a sled out in the open with no owner so we just took it and once we made it to our destination we were preparing ourselves to go down this amazing hill and it kind of went like this are you ready yeah let's do this Woo -hoo! <laughs> already know we ran for our lives but as we were running this motherfucker stopped and was like wait wait perla wait what come on let me just <laughs> okay run that's probably the face you're making and honestly i would be making that same face too and as funny as it was that day did not end so well and period like i admit that I deserved karma that day. So we were walking back home and when our lights turned red, I kept having the urge to just jump on a pile of snow. Cause like I got these cool military boots that my mom bought me and they were pretty expensive. So why not put it to the top? <laughs> and you know, I just, I just. Oh my god we looked for the boot for so long the boot literally disappeared i guess i have to go walk home with one boot in the freezing cold and i might get frostbites we can try going into payless and asking if we can borrow a shoe no i promise i'll bring it back lady uh you got money no i said i then no why can't you just let me borrow a discontinued boot or a shoe literally i know you are filled with shoes back there you need to get out there's literally a shoe in the garbage you can just give me that get out now you know what screw you and your fucking shoes i'm fucking leaving not because you told me to because i want to screw you <laughs> So that didn't work. Anyway, let me show you guys a map. We are right here and all I needed to do was walk this straight line and take a left and I'm home. And that's about like five blocks. And genuinely, I think my body could have handled it. Like, I don't know. I don't know why we didn't take this route. Oh, never mind. I remember now. So my friend told me that we can just go to his house instead since it's just like two blocks away from us. All we needed to do was go up this hill and we're at his house. And that means that he has the keys to his house, right? Like, why would you recommend going to your place with no keys? Only some dumbass would say that type of shit. I mean, who would really just... He didn't have the keys. Oh my god. My foot is gonna get amputated! 
I'm so sorry. I thought I had them. Um, we could just go to the nearest bodega and ask them for a phone so you can call your mom. I guess so. Or you could just leave me here because either way, I'm gonna fucking die. It was so embarrassing just going up to the counter and just like asking them for their phone so I can call my mom to pick me up because I lost my boot in the snow. Long story short, she didn't beat my ass. <laughs> She told me she was worried sick for me and that she didn't know why it was taking so long to come back home. <gasps> Is this what it feels like to be a runaway white girl? Not getting beaten? Just being missed? Whatever that hole is, is literally a fucking black hole. There's no way I couldn't find my boot the moment I lost it. This world we're living in is a simulation, and this is the living proof and evidence of the- <laughs> <laughs> Ah, what are you doing? Trying to break your snowman, stupid. What do you think I'm doing? Why? Cuz I feel like it! <laughs> what the hell? Holy guacamole! So that's what she was doing. Doing your mom! <laughs> See what I tell you, boo 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 boo? I helped you make your snowman a strong snowman, like you wanted. But how did Nord help my snowman not get hit? Isn't NordVPN some internet safety thing? I don't know myself, but it helped! If you aren't familiar with NordVPN, you should, honestly. It's the best when it comes to Ooh. internet security. Protecting your passwords, IP address, and internet traffic from dirty little hackers. Yeah, even pirating your favorite anime on a scummy website. What are you even watching? Sword on Online? <laughs> Without a VPN? First of all, ill. And second of all, good luck not getting your information leaked. And what's great about a VPN besides being your digital knight in shining armor is that you can easily have access to shows not available in your country. Look, watch me go from America to Germany. <laughs> Am I right, guys? So if you want to join me and surf the web safely with the best internet security, go on to the link in my description to get a two-year, one-month plan on NordVPN. And if for some reason you did not like your service on Nord, there is a 30-day money-back guarantee, so you don't gotta worry. Once again, check the link in my description, and thanks NordVPN for today's sponsor.